everyone, it's Desiree Nicole. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here or welcome back if you've been here before. Today I wanted to um, straighten my hair, blow dry my hair and straighten it because it's been a while. Sorry, my camera's falling. It's been a while since I've straightened or blow dried or did anything to my hair. I mostly just wear it curly or I wear it in a bun like this. And my hair has been in a bun, no lie, for like the past five days or so. So today I'm going to blow dry it and straighten it and see how long it's gotten. And that's what we're gonna do. So I received this package from Influencer. First of all, if you have never heard of Influencer, they are a company that you sign up and you do surveys and they basically um, have like little campaigns and if you're a fit for a, camp a particular campaign, they send you products in the mail for free and then all you have to do is review it and post your review or your thoughts about the product online. So I suggest you run over to Influencer, download the app. I signed up about two months ago and this is like my sixth box box that I've received. Um, so yeah, this one is from Dark and Lovely and it's the new blowout uh, kit that they have. So I'll be trying this out today and seeing how the product works and leaving my review online <laughs> about it. So um, yeah, I'll show you guys what's in the kit really quick and then we'll go ahead and get started. Alrighty, so when you open up the kit, um, this here, oh, this is what they um, normally send in the box boxes. It just tells you like where to go to post your review and all that good stuff. But this kit came with a uh, heat shield primer mist. It came with a shampoo. It came with a silky slip blow dry cream. Hmm, okay. And then this is a like a serum balm, supposed to like keep your hair from getting frizzy. And then this is the conditioner. So I will be using all of these products to blow dry my hair, straighten my hair, and we're gonna see how this works out for us. <laughs> So before I began uh, washing my hair with the shampoo, I uh, parted my hair into um, two quarters. And here you just see me kind of um, going through my hair, finger detangling. I know you're supposed to detangle, fully detangle after you condition and your hair is nice and damp. But I like to do both. I like to um, go through before I wash and kind of finger detangle um, the large tangles in my hair as you can see and then I'll go through with the comb and detangle again with conditioner in my hair so now that our hair is freshly cleansed after shampooing with the dark and lovely shampoo <laughs> I went in with the dark and lovely blow dry cream I wasn't sure exactly how much to, of this to put on but I did put on uh, put in a good amount as you can see um, this cream here is supposed to give some slip onto your hair, so it's supposed to make it easy to detangle and easier to blow dry. And, oop, girl, can't have a nip slip. Cover it up. All right, so the next thing I went in was the primer mist. This here is a heat shield. Um, you just spray it on before you add any heat onto your hair. I believe it said that it's supposed to protect your hair up to 450 degrees. So I just sprayed a good amount of this onto my hair and then I began the blow drying process.
hair are blow dried. The other side is like halfway blow dried. However, my kid wanted a snack. So I went to go turn my hair dryer off, slid it to the off position, and it kept, it got hotter. Like it just kept blowing hotter air. And I was like, what is going on? Like it's in the off, it's on off. Why is it still going? So basically I couldn't turn my blow dryer off. I guess it's broke. I still have the top part of my hair is still kind of wet because I didn't get to finish blow drying it. It's just an L for me, I guess. I, I, I don't even know at this point. My blow dryer is done. So I'm not gonna be able to finish blow drying my hair. I mean, it's like 90% of the way, but I still have this top part here that is still clearly kind of damp. So I think I'm just gonna stretch it. I'm gonna brush it down really good and stretch it, put it in a twist, and then start straightening the right side of my hair first. And hopefully that will help some, I don't know, I'm hoping. <laughs> but yeah, that was crazy. I don't, I don't even know. hair was flat ironed as you can see I was not feeling the ends girl they was dead and they was frizzy so I decided to get my shears and I just decided to give myself a little trim So the last step in this blow dry process is this serum balm. I just put this on the ends of my hair. It's just supposed to eliminate some of the frizz. So I added a little bit um, onto the ends of my hair and then went back over with the flat iron. This is like the final result. Um, I did end up putting some curls in it just because um, I can't help it. <laughs> Probably brush them out in a little bit and see if I can get like a little wave. But yeah, overall the dark and lovely uh, blowout cream, I think it did its, its thing, okay? So I'm gonna turn around so you can see the back. And out of all of the products, I will say this one right here was my favorite. This little um, serum balm. It, it looks like Vaseline, but when you put it in your palm, it melts like, like butter. It doesn't have a smell or anything like that, but yeah, it definitely keeps your hair, like there's no frizz. So yeah, I really love that. This is my first time straightening my hair since I can remember. I know it's been over a year at least. Um, but yeah, I gave myself a little trim. So yeah, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, let me know if you guys like hair videos. I can definitely make some more videos like that. All right, until next time, thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.